Hey, I'm Dan Davis. We're here at Thousand Hills, and I've got Soji Tabuchi with me today. And Soji and I have been out here working on our putting a little bit, and uh, uh, he's been kind enough to uh, share with you some of the points that he's learned today, and he's going to be demonstrating here. Um, Soji, go ahead and line up to the, okay. to the ball there. And uh, the first thing what we covered here with Soji is we wanted to make sure that Soji's lining up to the putt properly and that he's got his body in the best position possible to see his line and to be able to, to make that putt. And one thing I look for is that we want to make sure that his eyeballs are directly over his line. Uh, so, and that would be his intended target line. Go ahead and, and line up there, Soji. One way that you can check that is we're going to put a ball right basically in between his eyes, let it fall, okay? And you can see that landed just a little closer to him than his line. So if he can bend over just a little further and get his eyeballs over the ball just a little more, it's similar to if you're aiming a rifle and you had your eyes over here. We want to make it make sure they're looking right down your target line or right down the barrel. Okay, so one more. Go ahead and give it a, a good putt there, Soji. And again, you can check this yourself by just putting that golf ball in between your eyes and letting it fall, and gravity will show you where your eyes are in relation to your target line. Go ahead and hit one there, Soji. Okay, great. All right, next thing we're going to cover is we want to make sure that Soji's got a pendulum stroke in his, in his putting stroke. So go ahead and, and just take a couple swings without hitting the ball, okay? And Soji does this really well. Notice that Soji's arms are basically the only things moving here in his putting stroke. His legs and back and the rest of his body is perfectly sti still, just like on a pendulum of a clock, okay? And that pendulum is going to be in the exact same back and through until you come up and move the back of the clock and then you're going to get some some movement that you don't want That's so hard. yeah so very good there with this pendulum stroke we're going to move on through to distance control now the third item in making sure you're doing your putting correctly go ahead and line up the ball we've got a fairly short putt here about 10 feet it's not really uphill so he's going to take a rather short backswing about to here. Go ahead and hit one. And then if you notice what, what Soji did really well there, go ahead and hit, we'll hit just a couple more here, is Soji is actually taking a short backswing and extending through a little farther than he took it back. And now he makes sure that he's got the proper acceleration all the way to the hole and that I think is going to help you a lot and it's going to help you with that make sure you've got a nice consistent stroke right. and and keep you more on target and hopefully have have a little better games be able to beat Gail and all those guys you play yeah, with exactly. all right and so Soji you have been here you told me you said you've been in Branson since 1981 and you've had your own show for 21 years now that's year. that's make, pretty yeah, awesome yeah that makes came here 1981 and Time has changed, you know, around here. And yeah, it's wonderful. Um, this is uh, my twenty-first year. Twenty, twenty-one yeah, no, years having, here in Branson. On, on, on if you guys there. haven't seen Soji's show, it is truly remarkable. I, it was one of the first shows I I've seen since I've been here. My kids just absolutely love it. My wife loves it. You get all kinds of music in your show. You've got a little bit of country, a little bit of bluegrass. Soji's Everything. probably so, one of the best fiddle players on the planet, well, and we're, <laughs> we are blessed to have him right here in Branson with us, and uh, we're real lucky because uh, Soji gets to play Thousand Hills. We, we enjoy having him every day. Well, and and two, two holding one here, so, you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, so very good. Two holding ones. Um, and you might say just a little bit about the time your shows are. Yes, you've got sir. several different times that you yes, have some sir. shows. We, we do. We do three o'clock in the afternoon and the night show is 7 30 and our show is uh, consisting my wife Dorothy produced the show and Christina my daughter right uh, also sings you know yeah I knew uh, yeah. Christina was in the show when I was there yeah does an excellent job they, and, and so just got production awesome production he's got all kinds of musicians they most of them have degrees from what I understand uh, it's it's just really a neat experience we have fun fun do yeah it. And uh, 
by just talking to our concierge and yeah, get right. tickets yeah, right here for a thousand bills. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I know a lot of people ask if you're here. They they seem to know that you play golf out here, and, yes. <laughs> and uh, you're always real nice to the people, and and we really appreciate it. Thanks Thank for coming you. out. Thank All right. You for, thanks for the lesson. <laughs> no problem. Thanks, Sophie.